It's wonderful to be here celebrating Anthony and Cheryl's wedding. My congratulations to Bambi, who's as happy as myself, to your friends who love you both. All of you call him Anthony, but to me and our family, it's always been Tony. Growing up, Tony's dad took the family fishing often, therefore his love of fishing. As a child, he was easygoing and had a good sense of humor. He's a hard worker and fun to be with. His dad used to say, I wish he'd settle down and get married. Then along came Cheryl. She was smart, artistic, friendly, great personality, and liked diving also. But best of all is their three dogs, Gunner, Kaya, and Chance. One big happy family. Dad smiling, he got his wish. We all have been invited here to celebrate Cheryl and Anthony. Cheryl and I have shared good times, sad times, trying times, and fun times. Never knew what the next adventure was going to be. Mexico, Belize, Hawaii, London, St. Thomas. But the last adventure was to Florida and the best one yet. Cheryl called me and said, Mama, I think I met the right one. Not sure if he's interested in me. I told her, you'll never know unless you try. Keep trying and look where we are now. Cheryl is kind, caring, uber smart, and most of all, the most forgiving person I will ever know. Anthony is the best of you. Thank you. I am proud to have her call me mama. Much love and happiness to you both. I love you more than you will ever know.
So I was, I was on the plane flying here. I thought about all the other times I was flying in, over an ocean for Cheryl through the years. <laughs> Rob, I got in another no-fault accident in St. Thomas and got robbed by some locals. Come get me. <laughs> Rob, I came to Hawaii thinking it would be beaches and palm trees, but it's lava and meth heads. Come get me. <laughs> but thinking back, those trips remain some of my fondest memories with Cheryl. And hey, she picked some pretty nice places to get into trouble. And even in challenging times, Cheryl's warm smile and laughter would always manage to shine through. And we always had a blast in the end. Um, I'm not a crier, but with this skirt on, who knows, so I apologize. <laughs> this. But on those long return flights, I'd often wonder how Cheryl's story would play out. This engaging, tal talented, tough girl from Jersey Shore, who had to scratch and claw for everything she earned, the girl who showed my family unconditional love from the day she came into our lives to the point that my late mother ensured she always had a place at the table. You couldn't help but root that the rest of the world would see what we all saw in Cheryl. So for me, today is the continuation of that success story. Cheryl and Anthony, you inspire me as a couple. You are the true example of one plus one equaling three. As you support each other in your passions and careers and find new endeavors to pursue with endless energy. You showed me, you showed me that even after life punches you in the gut, never lose hope as you can still find true love and partnership. And as for the ending, well, I never imagined it would include me wearing a skirt, catching an owl as a bridesmaid in a Scottish castle. <laughs> but, then, <laughs> but then again, who expected anything less from this couple? And so for that fairy tale ending, I'll ask you all to raise your glasses in the Brazilian way to Anthony and Cheryl and toast to their health and happiness, which in Portuguese is pronounced saúde. Saúde! <laughs> Cheers. Love you guys. So Anthony and Cheryl, I have some questions to ask you. Will you take each other to be your life's partner? Will you solemnly and sincerely promise to cherish, love and comfort each other even when times are hard? We will. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> will you respect, support and honour each other at all times? Will you forever share friendship, fun, laughter and adventure together? Will you be trusting, loyal and forgive easily for the rest of your lives? And will you always remember these promises you've made to each other and remain true to them? Yes, we, yes, we will. We will. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Can we pass it back over? So, the honour of looking after the rings today has been given to our very special guest. Here we go. <laughs> oh. You want to take the rings? Wasn't that beautiful? Thank you. And um, would you untie them for me? <laughs> or ask one of the guys to do it. Would you untie that for us? Sure. Thank you. So could you give Cheryl's ring to Anthony, please? Thank you. <laughs> Unexpected <laughs> participation <laughs> in the ceremony. <laughs> Anthony, do you give this ring as a token of your love and commitment to Cheryl? I do. Go for it. Could you give Anthony's ring to Cheryl, please? 
Cheryl, do you give this ring as a token of your love and commitment to Anthony? I do. And she brought out a side in him I hadn't seen, and all for the better. A more well-rounded, stable, even sophisticated side. I never imagined a, a waltz, but <laughs> it, it was awesome. <laughs> they started to build a life together. Uh, they made a, a house into a beautiful home, an incredible investment property, and some fur babies to complete the family. <clears throat> and like me, he started to dive with the mindset that there was something important to come home to. <clears throat> I know we'll continue to raise the bar on our dive adventures until we're old and gray. But Cheryl and Anthony, your greatest adventure is just beginning. I'm so happy you found each other, and I love you both with all my heart. Thank you for including me in this special day and this amazing trip. Congratulations, and welcome to the family, Cheryl.